life around the place since the defeat on Friday? Yeah, obviously it's it's tough situation where we're in, you know, we know that and uh, but you know we need to keep the heads up. There's uh, there's need to be positive and then just look for the next game. So there's a, there's a still a slight chance. Have you been in a situation like this in your career before in the past? Mm, I wouldn't say so. No, I see it. every every situation is different. I think in even a game of football, it's it's uh, all the small things and so on. So uh, as I say, now we have four games to go. We're focused on the next one. We have a slight chance to go. So until there is, you know, slight chance to go, we fight till the end. Looks like blank against Ross County, but attacking wise, how do you feel, Ross County? Uh, how do you feel, Gareth Thistle? Uh, see, I think this. You know, all of the top six same, but bottom six, the, the, all the teams we play against each other now. See who gets the first goal in those games. I think is the crucial. You know, puts puts you puts you in your you know full, full forward steps. So there's been yeah a little bit can't you know can't go behind the luck and so on. But uh, all the things have been a bit of it against maybe. So as I said, we'll focus on the next one now. Saturday, massive game against Hamilton, and uh, we need to get three points there. How strong is the determination amongst the, the players to at least take the battle into another weekend? Yeah, as I said, we are positive. We we're ready to fight, and we need to do that now. It's it's uh, we've been been speaking about it, you know, weeks and weeks, and uh, <coughs> it's game of football, and uh, you know, we as I said, slight chance we keep believing and we keep fighting, and uh, we need to leave everything on the beach on Saturday. Has there been any any change in approach or or lift from the arrival of Morris Malpas? Yeah, obviously for the for the players, for the management, you know, it's a, it's a new new voice again, extra voice. So in training pitch and uh, definitely, you know, for the for the whole game, we go as a fully hundred percent focus and try to try to do the things we're good at and uh, try to beat the opposite team who who we faced in that that weekend. So. You know, we've done all what we could, so it's behind behind uh, all we all, all we can do is for for in our hands. So hopefully, we catch we won't sell it. Some fans have indicated they'll stay away from the game this weekend as a way of protesting about the way the club is run. What would your message to them be? I understand fans are disappointed all all this everything what's going on in the situation we're in, but you know, as I said, we have a slight chance still to believe and keep fighting, and we need to do that. Uh, better days are coming again, so we just need to be positive. And uh, you know, as as they are behind us, but I think you know, I think the real fans are behind us anyway. Is it good or bad? So we 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 trust them. I think they would they trust us. So we go and try to leave everything on the beach and get three points. I know you said you you couldn't necessarily look back at bad luck that you've maybe had in the past, but how important is it that we have? You know, strong decision making and good officials for these these crucial you know key games that could have a huge impact. Yeah, obviously, you know it's it's a important I think you know every way to the persons who what's what's their job to do the job in the highest level. So it is crucial for all the teams, top six, bottom six. So it's a massive game. So get the decisions right, get everything right, and then it's just down to on the beach. You know, who's the better team? So gets gets all good win.